Hey guys, welcome back to Exclusive Wraps. I'm Steve. Let's take you for a quick tour. First car I want to show you is this Honda Civic RS. This one received a full external color change in a Hexus glitter blue. Amazing color, contrasts really well with the gloss black. You can see really pops, especially when the sun's out, but it's pretty overcast now, so it's kind of hiding all that sparkle. But um, how cool does that look? Let us know what you think in the comments. Next up, we have the cell shade Mustang wrap that we're starting on. If you take a look back here, you can see we've started uh, testing panels. Uh, this kind of a wrap requires a lot of trial and error to make sure we land on all those body lines nicely and get it to follow, follow the hard lines of the car basically. But as you can see, it's starting to take shape. We've got a heap of prints ready to go on this. So in the next day or so, heaps of film's gonna go on and we'll take some more video footage and give you a look at that as well. If we go over to my left this way, we have an Audi A4 over here. This one is in for a full Expel Stealth paint protection film kit. So the whole car is gonna go from a gloss black to a satin black. We've taken all the badges off to give it a nice seamless finish. They're actually all off to be painted over at Cameron's Body Works as well. We are replacing the front grille as well. So the owner of this car bought a new grille, so we've taken the front bar off. That will get put in and yeah, the satin paint protection film will be will be put on shortly. This is going to look really cool. We'll take you inside unit eight, oh, unit nine first actually. So right here behind me, we have a street sweeper. This is one of the more obscure things we've been asked to wrap, but we've actually done a couple of these. Uh, this is for the company EcoSweep. So this one here is their demo sweeper, I suppose, if you will. They'll take this one out and show it off and sell it to people. We've done a couple of these now. This is a third one, I think. We've done one for, sorry, we've done two for two different universities. Can't remember which ones they are, sorry. But as you can see here, they're a very um, unique shape. So they make for a little bit of a challenging wrap. Um, but nonetheless, it's come up looking really good. To my right here is the plate sales Cayman. This is probably 80, maybe a little 75% complete. So most of the complicated full sides is done and lined up and lines up with the roof now as well. You can see we're just getting ready to throw the bonnet on, which has this sort of blue belt stripe that's going to line up across the front guards there with their logo on the middle as well. And then I think we've just got the rear bumper and a couple of little bits and pieces to go. It's going to look really cool. Koya rims also on the way. You'd have seen this one last week. Now, it is, I'd like to say almost complete, but there are a few little things that we're adding and modifying as we go. So the full stealth conversion has been done. All the gloss carbon has been PPF with Expel Gloss Paint Protection Film. And on this one, we're also going to add, I believe, some pinstripes all over this diffuser section here. So the final design is TBA still. Uh, keep an eye out for that. And I think we're still going to do some wrap on this rear wing section as well. But again, keep an eye on the page. You'll see that one at some point soon. And hopefully we're going to tint the headlights yellow too. That would be really cool. Let's go over to unit eight and give you a look in there. So over here, this is the bumper from the Audi that I showed you just before outside. So we've installed the front grille on this one. So he's got a nice black, all black grille, honeycomb style. That looks really cool. We'll put this one back. Now, White Tesla Model 3. Uh, this one came in for a full front pain protection film kit with Expel film. And it'll be coming back in a couple of weeks to also get a full ceramic coating. Unfortunately, it's taken a little bit of damage on the bottom side skirt there. So that's gonna get repaired first. When it comes back, we'll give it a clean up and we'll give it a full ceramic coating. This Jag F-Type on my left here is getting also full Expel paint protection film kit. So we've already cut up all the film for this one. It has a huge bonnet, so we're going to be using Expel's 72 inch roll film, um, which is big enough to cover pretty much any bonnet on any car. Uh, there's a couple that have some real big bonnets like the F12s, F-types, a couple other ones that I can't think of at the moment, but we'll use that for that one. And to finish up, we've got a Kia Stinger here, a uh, bright orange one. So this one's getting gloss black basically over the whole top of the car. So you've got the top of the boot lid, the roof, cant rails. For those of you who don't know, this part is called the cant rail. A lot of people get confused about that, but the part above the windows, that's what it is. Um, and the antenna as well, which I don't think it's done yet. Is it done yet? No, oh, it is somewhere. That about wraps it up for this week, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, we'll see you next week. And I slow it down, I slow it down, I slow it down.
Life up in the fast lane Pedal to the ground, pedal to the ground, pedal to the ground Living life up in the fast lane